Hello and welcome to my channel, Jolly Holiday with Mary. I am Mary and usually you will find me unboxing or talking about all things Disney and my dogs. I have two Boston Terriers and <laughs> they are everything. But today I am talking about my DB Method squat machine. I wanted to find out if people with chronic knee issues can do the DB Method without pain and injury. <laughs> I have had some knee issues for a while. My knees sound like this. And when I try to do squats of any kind unassisted, it's very, very uncomfortable and borderline painful. It feels like the tendons are moving in a way that they're not supposed to, and my balance is terrible. Squats are just super, super hard on my knees, and it was really defeating because so many people can do them. I see them doing it at the gym. My husband can do them without any problem. He loves doing squats, and I, I want to be able to build muscle in my legs and having a nice toned firm buttocks is definitely a goal as well so <laughs> i saw on instagram the db method it just kept popping up and popping up because instagram knows how to get you <laughs> and um, eventually i was like let's just do it i found a lady named megan posh i'll link her channel above on youtube she has great beginner videos super helpful i watched her videos and i was like okay i'm sold I'm gonna do this. She's also like a normal looking girl. She's not like super, super fit in the beginning videos. She looks great now, by the way. <laughs> really excited about her results and I can't wait to see my own. In any case, all of this led up to me buying the DB Method and I just wanted to share my experience as a person who is an average overweight lady <laughs> and I have chronic knee issues. So if you have chronic knee issues and you're wondering, can I do the DB Method? I wanted to answer that question for you. So far, I would say, yes, I love the DB method. My knees, I think crack maybe a little bit, but they don't they don't hurt at all when I'm doing it. it. It is incredibly easy to do. It's not easy to do, but it's easy on your knees. There's no pain, there's no discomfort when you're doing it. Um, the only thing I will say that I have noticed is when I do the plie squats. If you're doing a plie squat, like your feet are kind of turned out and you're working a different muscle group, um, I will say that when I do that, I do have some of my old problems. It doesn't feel good. So I've uh, changed up how I do the plie squats. If the video is doing like a full squat where you go all the way down, I do the plie squats, but I only go halfway. So I don't, my butt doesn't go past like knee level. That is the only thing so far that I have found that is a little bit of a challenge and uncomfortable. And I'm wondering if as my legs get stronger, maybe my knees will get better and I will eventually be able to do that. I guess if that happens, I'll do a follow-up video, <laughs> but probably gonna be a little while. But if your knees make horrible cracking noises and they feel terrible, I highly recommend the DB Method squat machine. It is so good. I have a whole playlist going with uh, my DB method experience so far. And that is pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to kind of answer that question from my perspective, from an average overweight person <laughs> at an average age, can you do the DB method if you have knee issues? And my personal answer is yes. I have found it to be extremely comfortable. It definitely gives you a great workout. You can feel it right away. <laughs> it is awesome. So I highly encourage you to get it. If you're thinking about it, I have not regretted purchasing it yet. And I, yeah, I can't say enough good things about it. So <laughs> I hope this helped you. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave me a comment down below and I will be happy to answer them. I will leave the DB Method website in the description as well if you wanna go check it out. And I think that's it. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Don't stay away too long.